Hello, in this video we are going to take a look at this book. It is called An Introduction to Planetary Physics, The Terrestrial Planet. It's by Kala, and it is part of the Space Science Text Series. This one is from Belmont College Williams Library. I'm just going to give it a whiff here. Mmm, smells nice. An Introduction to Planetary Physics. William M. Kala, Professor of Geophysics, University of California, Los Angeles. And here's the copyright, 1968. To Lewis B. Slichter. Let's take a look at the preface. This book is suitable for an introductory course in planetary physics. The subject matter is essentially the part of planetary physics that is dominated by solid matter containing as important constituents the common heavy elements, iron, silicon, magnesium, and others. By this definition, the parts of the solar system which with we are concerned are the terrestrial planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, plus the asteroids. Cool. And here are the topics. So you can see uh, what the book contains. So chapter one is on data pertaining to the Earth's interior. Chapter two is on mechanical and thermal aspects of a planetary interior. Chapter three is on planetary magnetism. And chapter four is on the dynamics of the Earth-Moon system. Let's go to the next page so you can see the rest of the contents, dynamics of the solar system, that's chapter 5, observations of planetary surfaces, that's chapter 6, geology of the moon, meteorites and tektites, constitution and origin of the terrestrial planets, and a bibliography, author index, and subject index. So lots of uh, problems. Now let's take a look at the exercises. Let's just jump to that. See what those are like. So we can get a look. So you see it does have exercises, quite a few. As you can see here, quite a few exercises. And I, I don't, let's just take a look in the back. Yeah, there's a, bibli there's a really big bibliography. It's huge. The, bibli the bibliography is ridiculous, but there's no answers. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's one of the things that's bad about this book. What's good about it is that it's a book on the subject. Um, there's not that many books on, you know, planetary physics. I mean, there's other books, but it's not like there's like hundreds. Yeah. Wow. So some serious mathematics uh, in this book. Let's go to the beginning, see what it's, what it starts. Data pertaining to the Earth's interiors. That's, that's pretty cool. Main parts of the Earth. Rocks and the geochemical cycle. this. This is cool. Some serious mathematics uh, in this book. Um, serious physics, right? This is pretty cool stuff. I don't know uh, if physics majors um, take this class. This is, this is you know, I, I've taken physics one, uh, physics two, and physics three. So I've taken three physics courses, but that's it. Like I haven't... Uh, I haven't studied, like I haven't taken a course on electricity and magnetism in its own right. Um, I have some books, but I've never taken a formal course uh, in those uh, advanced physics topics. But if you know, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming physics majors take this. If you've taken this, or if you know someone who's taken this, or if you know a physics people take this still, like if this is still a thing at uh, physics programs, leave a comment, I'm curious. Um, it's pretty hardcore. I feel like you would need to know a lot of math uh, to 
to learn this stuff. You also have to have a lot of willpower and I mean, it's hard, right? This is hard. Uh, it's hard stuff, um, but it's really cool. So yeah, planetary magnetism, expression of the external magnetic field. Let's read this, let's see what this says. The magnetic field at the Earth's surface normally is expressed in terms of a vector of magnitude F with a radial component positive downward, A, and a horizontal component, H. Because the classical technique of observing the magnetic field utilized the deflection of a magnetized needle, there are also used the angle with respect to the horizontal, the inclination I, and the angle about the vertical with respect to north, the declination D. Equations 3.11 and 3.12 give the relationships between the rectangular components of the magnetic field vector and the angular quantities I and D. Oh, wow. Interesting. Cool. Observations of the Earth's magnetic field. Yeah. Paleomagnetism, ferromagnetism. Very, very specific stuff in this book. More math here. Oh, it's got a thing here. This is where the uh, people check it out. Uh, library card. Oh, uh, I think I think it's missing. Yeah, what is that? It's like stuck to it. Yeah, we can't see. Uh, well, we can't see who checked it out from the Belmont College Library. Um, that's where this is from. Again, the copyright on this one what was it 19, 1968. Yeah, nineteen sixty eight, Los Angeles. John Wiley and Sons. William M. Kaula. That's his name, Kaula. Yeah, it's supposed to be for an introductory course, so I mean, I'm guessing undergrads take this, right? Um, but it seems like it, it could be pretty tough. Um, yep. Hardcore. And it talks about journals and stuff. Hmm. It says here, the book most comparable with this text and subject matter, so this is old, by the way, so keep that in mind, is The Solar System. Okay. So there was another book called The Solar System that was very similar to this book. Yeah. I mean, this is a monumental task to write a book like this. Pretty, pretty amazing. Kaula. Ka ka kaula. I said it correctly. Anyways, I'll, I will look uh, for this book. If I can find it, I will leave a link in the description. Ocean Tide Problem. It's always something interesting in the book. Also, if you want to learn math, um, I do have courses. They're on my website, mathsorcerer.com. They're actually on Udemy, but if you get them, uh, please use the links from my website uh, because I lowered the prices and it helps me greatly. And if you found any value in this content, feel free to subscribe. This is interesting. I mean, I'm just... I'm. Shocked. I mean, it's an introductory course, undergraduate physics course, probably, I guess. Um, but if you know, leave a comment. Looks pretty hardcore, though. An introduction to planetary physics, the terrestrial planets by Kaula. Take care.